All right, this is Chris here again, and we're back at the Crown Royal 7300E outdoor wood boiler. And so in this video, we're just going to talk a little bit about how much wood we've used so far this year. So we started this wood boiler up this year, uh, October 24th. It is now December 30th. And so we've used so far right about 2.3 cords, given my, you know, it's a little bit of estimating <clears throat> calculation you know there's 128 cubic feet in a cord and so I've calculated up the wood pile here and uh, so we've used a, a full row on the back side of the pile uh, which I'll show you in a minute uh, a little bit of that was some softwood that I had so we mixed that in at the beginning of the season since you know it wasn't really high demand so we didn't need the high BTU output on that uh, and then we had a partial cord um, that we used in that of all ash wood. Uh, we got that from a local guy, uh, delivered that. I was worried about, you know, we, we got the wood supply a little late in the season this year, so uh, I wanted to make sure we had some drier wood, so I've been trying to mix that ash in where it does dry pretty quickly um, with everything else. So, uh, But here I'm going to insert a picture of the November uh, kind of average temperatures in our area and then also the December average temperatures just to give you an idea I know when we were looking at these we always wondered well you know this guy says they only use this much wood and this guy says this much but it's kind of hard to tell if you don't a know what area they're in or b uh, know kind of what the average temperatures are at because places where they only get down to maybe 40 degrees in the middle of the winter uh, you're going to use a lot less wood there than you are here, where we're going to get down to, you know, sub-zero temperatures. Not consistently, but it's, you know, it's going to get there. So, <clears throat> you know, it's just nice to know kind of the, the average temperatures going on here mixed with how much wood we're using. So, so far this year, 2021, going into 2022 soon, uh, that's going to be about two and a quarter, 2.3 cords uh, this year so far. So, not terrible. Uh, we're definitely still learning about this wood boiler. This is the first uh, gasifier wood boiler that we've used. And so there's definitely a little bit of a learning curve there, figuring out what to use, what not to use. While we're out here, we might as well open up the boiler and see how she's doing. I just loaded it just a few hours ago this morning, but... That's what it looks like when you first push the button to get the fire going again before you open it up and then it clears right off. I think a lot of it depends on the moisture content of the wood as well. So the wetter the wood is, the little more it's going to steam or smoke. But let's see what this looks like. A lot happening. But yeah, so that's uh, just a little update on how much wood that we've used so far this year. So hope you had a good Christmas time with your families this year and New Year's right around the corner. And let me know in the comments what your uh, New Year's resolutions are for 2022 if you got those. Uh, mine's going to be hopefully burning less wood. Uh, I know I'm already burning less oil because I'm not burning any, so it's fantastic. So anyways, uh, upcoming video though, we're going to make a video on how this whole thing gets tied into... The, the existing house system. I know I had a comment or two on that wondering how this whole thing gets piped in and, and how it ties into giving us heat inside. So uh, we'll be making that hopefully soon and uh, you guys have a, a safe happy new years uh, with your families and we'll catch you on the next one.